Okay, so um, today we are gonna download and install Windows 11 on my Apple Mac Mini. It's Mac Mini M4 and sometimes I need access to uh, some Windows software and we are using Parallels Desktop today to install that. The good thing with Parallels Desktop actually when you install it for the first time it's asking you if you want to install Windows. That's what we are doing but of course with Parallel Desktop you could also install Ubuntu or any other Linux software but in my case we actually go with the free settings of Parallels so when you really install Parallels it's gonna ask you right away do you want to install Windows and it's downloading Windows 11 directly from Microsoft of course the ARM version and if you want to test it out and if you have Parallels desktop you can just run Windows on your Apple Mac it's running pretty fast on um, any Apple Mac with a Mac silicone and it's actually running pretty fast also on my Mac mini with the M4 chip so I have chosen to and you see that later uh, go with the standard settings which means it comes with six gigabytes or it takes away six gigabytes of the 16 which I have available and that should be fast enough and rest you see in the video it's actually pretty straightforward it takes approximately 15 minutes um, from downloading parallels to install uh, windows 11 and after 15 minutes you can actually run uh, windows 11 on your apple mac if you have a mac with an original or with a uh, apple silicon it worked in the past as well with other Windows distributions. If it, if it happens that you still have a Mac which runs an Intel chip, you might could even run older versions of Windows, but for my use case, Windows 11, it's uh, pretty good. And with the ARM chip or with the ARM chip version of Windows 11, it's actually pretty fast and has a good performance.